Good morning, everyone. Well, today we have a look at Luke's Gospel, chapter 4, verses 31 to 37. And it is the uh, situation where Jesus, um, uh, he, he cleans a man who is possessed of an unclean devil. And he speaks with authority. And people were uh, impressed by this, that Jesus spoke with authority and that the devil listened to him and came out of, uh, out of this man. And reports of Jesus' ability to, to control devils and unclean spirits, it says in the writings, the, the, the reports of him went all through the surrounding countryside. Uh, you can I remember, of course, people weren't using any kind of technology in those days, so it would be hearsay. People were passing it on. Do you hear about what happened? Do you hear what happened? And word we'd spread around all over the place. And, and so people were amazed. And then Jesus did something even more amazing, and that is that when he died, he rose again. Jesus rose from the dead. Can you imagine how word spread around and how people were amazed and, 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 and fascinated and drawn to this? Have we forgotten about those, those things? Are there those things, you know, those wonderful things that Jesus did that should hold us, hold our attention all the time. That Jesus performed miracles. That Jesus rose from the dead. And why? For each one of us. For each one of us. To show this, us that there is life after this. And that we should prepare ourselves well for it. And we should continue to be fascinated and stand in awe of just how powerful Jesus really is. And I didn't say was, how powerful he really is and how much he can do. And so let us today just express our appreciation for everything that Jesus did in his lifetime and during the, our lifetime, uh, because it is a wonderful experience and we are so privileged to be a part of his family. So you have yourselves a wonderful day and we'll see you again. God bless. Bye-bye.